dear viewers today we are going to see the experimental on va cars 6 and efficiency of the solar pv system which is available in anna university university uh, experiment uh, renewable energy lab that is uh, experiment on va cars 6 and efficiency of solar pv system however that is uh, here we are going to do the uh, virtual experiment due to uh, the current situation we are going to do that uh, that is a virtual experiment uh, before entering to the uh, matlab simulink file we are going to clarify about the basic simulink uh, uh, equivalent module of the system right so for that purpose this is the solar pv basic equivalent circuit this is one current source this is the uh, diode which is available in reverse bias that is the function of this okay next one is rss series resistance next one is shunt resistance this is the basic vi cars 6 we are expected to obtain during our experiment okay right so this is a uh, red color is a iv color uh, iv cars 6 of pv array blue color which is the pv cars 6 of the pv array isc is a short circuit current voc is a open circuit voltage imp is a current for the maximum power point at your notch point vmp is the voltage for maximum power at the notch point okay before entering uh, to that uh, uh, matlab file we are going to see the basic things uh, from the uh, book. So this is the basic uh, Sumulink MATLAB model. Basic uh, that is MATLAB model. So here we are obtained this curve. This is the curve that is the PV curve then IV curve. So here that is the basic equations. This is the basic equation for I is equal to PV. Uh, minus of i naught exponent uh, of this equation so this equation which we converted in the matlab code this is the another equation so the entire equation uh, for the pv system is to be taken from this book okay from the data which can be uh, taken from this book um, this is the book which is available uh, that is the pv and iv cars 6 Again, uh, this is the MATLAB uh, model. This is the current source because the photovoltaic array which will be treated as the uh, current source. Again, this current source will be connected through uh, connected into that uh, the one parallel uh, resistance which may be converted into that uh, the voltage source, the source conversion principle. So again, that is RS. What is that? The series resistance. Here the current measurement and the voltage measurement which is available. A variable resistor which can be connected between the this port number 1 and 2. That is positive and a negative terminal. Okay. Now uh, the inside of that the block. The computation of the equation IM. That is maximum current. So which is we are going to compute as like this. This is the basic module which can be implemented uh, on uh, uh, here uh, that is uh, which is implemented on that uh, here um, for that that is what is the i value maximum i value we are going to obtain uh, which may be in the matlab implementation again i naught we are going to implement it in the matlab that is uh, we are already we are implemented so again that i naught that is the another uh, that is diode function value which has uh, implemented Again, the voltage and the current equation which is uh, available here, right? So, the entire uh, the equation obtained in that uh, process, we are implemented in the MATLAB Sumilink. So, this is the basic MATLAB code for solving that the uh, PV based array. Again, the output of this program, that is I value, which is uh, fed into the uh, uh, current source feeded into the current source IPV. This is the IPV. This value which is uh, feeded into that the uh, current source. This I value. 
so the same program uh, we are obtained here where is this is the editor so please see so what is this same uh, program we have typed and uh, obtained that uh, the program which is available in that uh, book so we are obtained again we are going to run this program so we are obtained the same cars 6 uh, for the uh, iv cars 6 and uh, next one is the uh, pv cars 6 this is iv cars 6 this is a uh, pv cars 6 so this is closed now uh, the we are going to the matlab 5 matlab simulink file so this is matlab uh, simulink file so this is the uh, file which is we are going to see so this is the basic equation uh, model which is available in the uh, mathwork file exchange we are taken this we are obtained this model and then edit it further okay right so this is that uh, the uh, basic model we are going to obtain by using that the book which is available uh, information here that is the same current source this current source controlled current source value we are obtained by using this plug uh, so n number of files in the mathworks which is available but at the same time all are uh, having that is the signal processing there is no power processing file is very low file so for that purpose uh, this video which may be going to useful uh, for the uh, viewers this signal value which may be going to converter by using the current controlled source this is the one of the variable resistance we are going to obtain by anti-parallel current source in series with the resistance we are obtained that the uh, variable resistance uh, for the different values now so this is that the, now we are going to entering uh, the values of uoc open circuit voltage short circuit current number of uh, uh, arrays which is uh, going to connected in cells in this uh, uh, part next to parallel resistance uh, u value that is the uh, diode reverse uh, uh, part value next one is that is the rs which means the series resistance okay so these values we are entered now we are going to simulate uh, the uh, the entire setup how the PV curve will be obtained. Okay, now I am going to start the simulation. So, this is a, now I am uh, going to simulate. So, yes, which is available. So, I am going to take an as that the uh, PV curve here that is available in the PV curve. So, now I am fix the irradiation at most in the maximum 1000. So, I am going to uh, uh, reduce uh, from 1 by 1. So, it is possible. So, if, if it is possible, again the curve may be tilted. Suppose if it is you are in the very low position, low uh, resistance, again we are going to run. So, that is the new run which is available. So, I am going to fix for small drawing again 1 amps, again further, again further again this is the further improvement the small small improvement of that curve so this is the curve which is obtained so this is the position this is the position which is obtained the pv curve step by step so each and every time you have going to take the reading and then plot uh, in the excel or as usual so this is nothing but the rheostat which can be varied uh, uh, load depends upon that uh, your requirement now i am going to simply change some other uh, the 800 irradiation uh, irradiations so that is in the different values so uh, we are going to uptime so i am also going to change this uh, uh, again further low resistance and then run it is this uh, create some that uh, uh, the processing again i am going to uh, run the uh, simulations so this is again again so again i am going to run this is may it may be going to run it will take in this part so again i am also going to up the get the simulation for the pv curve so this is the entire uh, setup 
we are going to see the um, basic things of the experimental characteristics of a PV system as per that is the Anna University syllabus. Okay, right.